This is the difference between visceral, somatic, and neuropathic pain. Visceral pain has an origin in the internal organs. It can be caused by inflammation or damage to the internal organs. It's usually poorly localized and poorly defined. It's often described as dull, aching, or colicky, and it can be intermittent or come and go. It might have referred areas outside the site of injury, and it might be accompanied by motor and autonomic reflexes. The innervation of the visceral organs are sympathetic and sensory afferent fibers, and they spread over several spinal cord segments. There's a relatively low number of axons compared to total neural output. Somatic pain, on the other hand, originates in soft tissues or bones. It can be inflammation or disease in the soft tissues or bones. It's usually well localized and described as sharp. It's usually constant, and it increases with movement. The innervation is typically restricted to one or two spinal cord segments, and there's more precise nerve mapping compared to visceral pain. Lastly is neuropathic pain. This originates in the nerves themselves. You can have inflammation or damage to the nerves, as you can see in this picture in the background. It's typically described as electric or sharp pain, and it's directly related to nerve damage or dysfunction.